Every maker needs a space, whether you're a gardener, a woodworker, a tattooer, a painter, an illustrator, a designer, a writer. If you make stuff, a space is quintessential to making things. And I'm a firm believer in respecting this space. It can be as simple as a closet, a part of a room if you have a studio, anywhere that's dedicated to just making. Does it look like Mickey Mouse? But to me, the ultimate solution to these making spaces is the outbuilding. So essentially, it's a studio space that's just outside of the main house that you live in, but it's still on the same property. And that's what the art house is. It's technically a prefabricated tough shed. Essentially, it was just studs sheathing with a roof and everything else I've done. This art house has been my first four, four, yay, four way, four, four, a, four, four, yay, frenet into finishing out a space. It has a loft in it and a main floor, but when it was built, there were no stairs to the loft, so I had to figure out how to build stairs. Then I had to do all the insulation in here and then hang the wallboard for the ceiling on the walls and do the flooring. And the satisfaction of finishing a space or making a space that I can make within is kind of an ultimate scenario for me. One room is done, but now I gotta finish the bottom room. And right now I'm working on all the wallboard and it's just slow and steady. What I've been doing for the wallboard in the main floor is taking sheets of four by eight ply, half inch, and ripping them down into eight inch widths so that they turn into boards. And then these boards I'm laying out along the walls. It's like a staggered board look. Then I decided, hey, what if I actually painted on some of these sheets of ply before I ripped them down? All the windows and all the electrical things, they're slow as hell. It's a lot of measuring, tedious, cut it, place it up, realize something doesn't fit right, cut it. Roadblock. First I thought this board was too short and this one looks too short. It turns out the big one is just too long. So now I have to pull that off and then rip that one down. Basically. Work with what you've got. It's not a race. Practice makes the master. Have I mentioned this is recovery day? Success. This wall is complete. Several speed bumps, but all good. Actually, now all the walls are done. I just went for it, finished it up. All is finished. It's a very big accomplishment. And on to the next. So one big step is done. Sooner than later, this place is going to be a functional space.